Hello everybody, what is up? Welcome to video number four of PLR Powerhouse, which is all about e-covers. Now, without a good e-cover, your product will not do well, and that's something I can guarantee you of. You need an e-cover because you need your product to have a, you know, an image representation of what it truly is. E-covers are really important. They give people a glimpse of what to expect from the product inside. They get people excited and get them, you know, a little more curious about your product and if e-cover is really good it induces an emotional reaction and gets people you know excited about what they what they can expect from the purchase so let's take a little quick ex uh, glimpse of what e-covers usually look like uh, here's a random collection of e-covers some different uh, digital products all of them are I would say are pretty attractive ones the reason that you need an attractive e-cover is again uh, it gets people much much more hyped up about making that purchase and parting with that five dollars that ten dollars whatever your uh, product might cost and some of these are pretty good e-covers as well if you can see this one on the right instant cash strategies I mean that's something you'd want to buy as a customer because you know who doesn't like cash who doesn't like making money and if you're offering instant cash strategies, it's a lot more attractive than saying uh, 10 ways to make your first dollar online or something like that. Though that isn't a bad title in, in, in and of itself, actually. So here's some more e-covers. And as you can tell, an e-cover doesn't necessarily have to be a book. Uh, while a PDF file usually depends on what... Uh, you're selling as a product. So if you're selling a PDF file, people would usually expect you to have an ebook representation of that file. Whereas if you're selling videos, you might expect a DVD case along with some CDs and DVDs on the side. And if you're selling software, you might uh, some people might expect you to have a 3D box representing that software like a WordPress plugin or perhaps a WordPress theme or something. So why are e-covers important and why should you be focused on getting a good as e-cover as possible? Well, like I said before, they elicit an emotional reaction in your customer, get them excited, get their blood pumping, and they give people an idea of what to expect from your product. So good looking and attractive e-covers will give people the impression of a good product that's worth their money, which makes them a lot more likely to purchase that product. I mean, if you have a good e-cover that's attractive, has a catchy title, people are uh, going to have an uptick in interest because that elicits desire. I mean, now they want that, and they're uh, they'll take a look at your sales letter to see if the product fits them. But once you have a good e-cover and you have their desire like that, it's all downhill from there. But now, on the other hand, if you have an inspiring, boring e-cover, that's not going to get anyone's attention. It won't get them excited. You want to have people who are pumped up. So that's kind of combining a good e-cover with a good title. E-covers are one of the fastest ways to get people's attention and spark desire in your buyers. And e-covers should be catchy looking. It should have some color. It should have some bold font and you get people excited about the content and the product inside which, which is where having a good headline in other words having a good title a subtitle comes in so the next question is how do you get your e-covers done usually uh, to create your e-cover you need to have a photo an image that's already ready to go an uh, image that uh, that you want to be the face of the product uh, then after that it's just a matter of slapping it on a digital e-cover and like repositioning it so it's a finished product so generally like I say you place your photo your product image that you have created already beforehand onto the ebook cover or the e-cover in general then you just get the e-cover done now if you have expertise to do it on your own 
you can use the programs we've already gone over like GIMP and Photoshop to create your e-cover but for newbie uh, internet marketers you might find that to be a little bit complicated luckily though there are several other options that you can use well some are free and some are paid that can quickly you can use to quick, quickly create your e-covers with so let's go ahead and take a look at what's available in this regard one of the most popular e-cover generators out there is my e-cover maker which is both paid and free there's some paid uh, some paid styles and some free styles that you can use uh, my eCover Maker is a subscription service that lets you download as many eCovers as you want at just $14.95 per month. Or alternatively, you can just create an eCover and download it at $4.95. It offers a few free eCover models and styles for you to choose from, so it, you don't necessarily have to pay, which is a, a great thing. My eCover Maker comes with a lot of templates, like more than 85 of them. It has an option to download 2D or 3D e-covers, depending on what you prefer. There are lots of fonts, lots of text effects, styles, there's lots of graphics to go into your e-covers. Let's go ahead over there and let's take a look, shall we? My ecovermaker.com. So this is what the site looks like. Once you head over to myecovermaker.com, you can check it out. Like I said, it's, it's a subscription service for $14.95 per month for unlimited downloads. But you, there are some free models, so you don't necessarily have to pay right away if you don't want to. To create the e-cover, just head on over to create e-cover on the top, navigate up there. And then you need to click on the type of e-cover that you want to create. So like I said, a lot of these are paid. Uh, e-covers such as the paperback book standing which is the one that's most popular with a lot of information products there's some lying down ones some notebooks you know this and that the software boxes the DVD cases and there's even some uh, Mac screens and iPad screens and so on they definitely have a lot of choices so you can get your money's worth if you sign up at $14.95 per month but let's go with one of the free ones, shall we? The paperback stack. Now they'll say, select an image to use as a background for your e-cover. Uh, you can use one of the ones they already have. You can upload your own, which only registered members can do. You can pick colors and custom web resources. It's free, like free stock photos and free backgrounds. Let's use one of these ones just to half as an example. So let's say select and continue. Now you're going to want to insert text PLR video payday. Alright. And let's just go ahead and click finalize. takes a while to load so let's just wait a moment and bam that's what it looks like not necessarily the most attractive e-cover I admit but I'm just doing this as an example and then you can choose to download it in 3D or 2D so that's what my e-cover maker can do excuse me let's go on to the next one which is online 3D package okay online 3D package is at 3d-pack.com it gives it's a free option that lets you download online 3D packages, e-covers whatever you like in order to use this service you've got to have your images to upload at the ready in other words, the images for the front and sides, etc. for your e-cover needs to be ready to go. The 3D package site is going to let you then handle the rest of the assembly. So this site is more like a finishing station than it is creating an e-cover from scratch. After you're done, all you need to do is download the finished product in 
PNG, JPG, or GIF formats if you want. And tutorials are available right on the website homepage, so you don't need to go very far. There's just a couple of YouTube's videos on the left that you can just take a look at and learn how to use a service yourself. Again, Online 3D Package is another free service. Let's go ahead and take a look at it, shall we? So here are the YouTube videos that will teach you how to use a service on the side. But let's just go ahead and do a quick one. So it has to choose a cover. Let's see. Oops. Wrong folder. Video payday. Then you uh, upload the other parts of the image as well. Once you're done with that, you can take, use a mouse to drag it around, rotate it, look up, look down, and make sure that it's something you want to download. And when you're done, all I have to do is just click the Create 3D box. So that's that. Now the next option is something called eCover Creator. It's a paid service. It's $9.99 per year. It's an upgrade over the online 3D package, uh, 3D package uh, website. The downside, however, is that it's a paid option that you have to use. Now this site comes with lots of templates and elements and styles and all sorts of things for you to choose from. There's images tools, text tools, this is probably the most functional of any of the sites I've shown you yet. And they also have over 200 bonus templates for you to check out with. So let's take a look at this one as well. ThreeDCoverMaker.com. Uh, so this is what the site looks like. eCover Creator. Let's go ahead and start with the demo. It's going to ask you to select a cover, ebook, the software box, DVD, even a credit card, the classic and the software box. You're able to rotate it. This is what the interface looks like. It's actually a very attractive interface. You can load your background image, which is what we'll do again. Not quite what we want. Got to make it just right. Something like that. So, as you can see, it'd be a work in progress and you have to know what you're doing. But once you're done, you can click the download button, just click next, and they'll let you download. Of course, the download isn't available in the demo version. You'll have to pay a uh, $9.99 per month fee. And finally, we have the last and the best option in my eyes, which is Fiverr.com. If you don't want to go through the hassle of creating an image and then creating an e-cover, making sure it's attractive as possible, just pay someone $5 and they'll just take care of what you need. You can outsource anything at Fiverr.com, almost anything at all. So if you want your e-cover to look professional as possible, what I recommend is that you just uh, let someone else do it for you, someone who's a pro at it. Unless, of course, you have great experience in graphic design, in which case, by all means, handle it yourself. So let's take a look and go to Fiverr.com. Fiverr.com. So, like it says up on the banner here, this is the world's largest marketplace for $5. You can outsource GIFs, graphics, video, social media, things like writing, music, advertising. Uh, just back, if you want to get your backlinks done here, you can too. This is just one of the best sites on the internet, in my opinion, especially for internet marketers. 
Now for folks like us who are going to need a graphic for their PLR products, all you have to do is click on graphics. Or better yet, all you really need to do is just type eCover. And then here you are uh, with a lot of different uh, freelancers who will do the product for you. Now if you want someone who is good, click on rating. Always click on rating first. And then you'll see all sorts of folks who will do different services for you. For example, VIK and Charlie will make a ebook cover or full book cover with extras for $5. Sevgraph, who's actually someone I've outsourced to in the past, will design a high converting ebook cover in 11 different formats. In, this, in other words, like 11 different e, e cover formats. He'll uh, do a CD, an e box, a software box, an ebook, and so on and so forth. Some of these gigs also come with extras, so if you're willing to fork over the extra cash, they'll uh, do extra services for you. As you can see, this person here has a 99% rating of satisfaction, which is pretty high. Anything over 90 is good, and anything over 95% is excellent. You can see that he already has four orders in the queue at the moment. And uh, if you order this gig from him, it will take three days to complete it. That's the estimated time of delivery. Uh, most of the time, though, they uh, finish faster. So always, always take a look at the feedback. So this person has 1,107 happy reviews and seven, and seven negative reviews. And you know, if you just skim, scroll down here, skim through the, the feedback, you'll see that it's pretty positive stuff. Now one other thing for the speed-minded internet marketer is look for express gigs. Express gigs take 24 hours or less. That's about as fast as you can ask for from a freelancer. And again, it's all for five dollars. Now, if you want to click, if you want to order a gig, if you choose that is the right one for you, just click the order now button. It'll take you to PayPal. And once you're at PayPal, you'll need to enter your login information, log in to PayPal. Five will take care of the rest. You'll receive a confirmation email in your inbox and it'll take you to an order screen where the freelancer will immediately uh, if they need anything from you the freelancer will immediately uh, write down a, a pre-written question you need to answer that before the order can start so that's that Fiverr is probably in my opinion it's the best option out of anything and it's actually what I use right now to create my PLR video payday e-cover which is this. So if you can recall, that's, uh, it's in line with the header of the site that we already modified. PLR Video Payday, discover how to great power. PLR videos can lead to a massive cash payday. So like I said, you want your ebook to be attractive and something that people will want to open up for themselves. So that's pretty much it for e-covers. All you need to do is go out there and get an e-cover done. If you want to get it done for free, there are some options that I've already listed. If you want to, if you're willing to fork over some cash, my recommendation is that you just go to Fiverr, pay five dollars, and it'll be done all right for you. It's just a quick investment. So that's that. We'll see you in the next video.